more now from TVC News. Ikena Mechi, who joins us live from Delta State. Hello, Ikena. So what more uh, is the Delta Labor Congress saying about uh, this strike and their willingness, if at all, to pursue it? Well, I, I didn't get you very clear there, but if I know what you're saying, um, the Delta State um, chapter of the Nigerian Labor Congress and the Trade Union Congress are actually uh, uh, sticking to the directive earlier uh, given by the national body that they should embark on strike on the 16th, which is today. And this morning, early this morning, every ministry department and agency uh, office were in. Uh, uh, we, uh, we are locked, and of course, the only office that is open right now in Delta State is the government house, which um, some workers say they could have joined others, but, you know, the government house is not locked. But for other places here, workers are actually outside waiting, uh, you know, couldn't access their office today. Residents uh, observing the impact of the strike in Delta State. Well, it's going to be it's massive. Apart from banks that are opened, um, other offices are actually closed. They, are, they, they lock them and they are manning their men there to ensure that uh, nobody uh, gain entrance into those buildings. Uh, and so it's going to affect uh, the economy of this state uh, very well because of uh, when you look at it, I don't see any other states that actually heeded to this directive to go into the, go to strike. Uh, because for, according to the secretary, innocent, um, uh, uh, you know, uh, he said that the directive was standing and that's why they embarked, that's why they ensure that the, the lock up offices this morning and workers couldn't assess their, their offices. All right, Ikena Mechi, that will be all for now. No, we'll get back to you for updates uh, from your end.